What's up, everybody? It's Quentin here. It's the writer behind the livemoregreen.info blog. And right now, I just wanted to make a video just to kind of give you a little sneak peek into the window of my life. Just tell you, you know, where I come from and how I was brought up and what I'm doing right now. You know, just so you can get on the level so you can see who I am, you know. So, um, moved down to Georgia when I was like 13 was in Douglas County, graduated from Douglas County High School, played football, great grades, did all the good things. And so after I graduated, I went to Georgia State for about three years, hated it. From the first day I got there to the last day I was there, it's like my motivation to stay there just died. It went from here all the way down. Like I, I just wasn't feeling the school, the college thing. It, it just felt too cliche, like everybody was doing it. You know, I felt like if everybody's going to school and getting a degree, what makes a degree so special? You know, I just felt like I was in this box and I, I just, I was hating it, just truly hating it. So I eventually, I remember my last day at Georgia State, I was taking a test. I had enough. I got up and just walked right out, never looked back. So from then, you know, everybody was just getting on me, dogging me, just talking about what do you do? want to do? You're sorry. You know, everybody get this preconceived notion if you don't want to go to school it's like you don't want to do anything but that's just not the case I was just needed to find you know my path of my talents my passion needed to find that so after that I went to Chattahoochee Tech to major in horticulture because by the way my passion is growing food and nature and plants and that whole field so I was like well why not go to school and major in that so I went to Chattahoochee got there was not feeling that whatsoever. I felt like I was being pushed. I was doing something just to satisfy everybody else. And that's really not the way to go. Don't do anything just to satisfy anybody else because you're going to hate it. It makes no sense to do that. So I did it. And two weeks after that, I stopped going there. So literally right now, I have two schools right now that I owe money to. I'm in hella debt right now. But I'm not ashamed to say it. I'm in debt student debt you know i went down that road of trying to go to school wasn't for me so here i am today you know um i work part-time valet you can see it right now i literally just got off right before i start shooting this video and just a just a, a year and a half ago i my passion like i said my passion is to grow food so i decided to create a business that would install vegetable gardens for people you know me and my brothers uh, the name of the business is called Ruach Ikad. It's a Hebrew name for one spirit, you know, describing the style of gardening that we do. You know, we like to, everything is connected in one. So we try to have that name reflect our, our style of work that we do. And we, we do work now, you know, we, we have a contract with the Beltline and we do, we install gardens for people here and there, give advice, you know, put up community gardens, help do stuff like that, you know. So we're doing a little bit of things here and there. And and also, what else about me? I'm 23. I'm married. My wife right here. She's over there cooking. Say hi to the camera. Hi, camera. Doing what a good wife is supposed to do. No, I'm just joking. I'm just joking. But she cooks for me. Definitely a blessing in my life. But just trying to give you a, trying to let you see who I am. So just actually uh, about a month and a half ago, I could start getting into internet marketing. You know, I actually ran across this from a friend of mine. He introduced me to this. So when I looked at it, I was just like, hmm, this could actually change the way I do business with my business, any business. So I needed some money to start up this little online business. So. I didn't have much, but I have two other brothers that that we do business together. So we all always put our money together to, to do things. So we start doing this and it's actually been opening my eyes to, to the way I do business. So it's going to actually help a lot. And I encourage you to look into it and to, and to look, look, look into Internet marketing because Internet marketing is actually the future, like using the Internet to your advantage for your business would do wonders. It will, it will, it will do a lot. So that's why you see me doing blogging and trying to get on social media and connect with people and making videos like this, because I want you to see, get connected to me on a level so that you know me and 
see where I'm coming from and see my background and see that I'm not just this person that's just blowing smoke like if I tell if I'm showing something on Facebook or my blog alone this is something that's coming from my head and I, I'm always just trying to about I'm just trying to help people I, that's my ultimate goal I want to help people I want to be successful so I can help other people and one of the f number one ways to get successful is to help other people be successful so that's my goal to do that's why I always that's why I'm an, I'm an advocate for network marketing because network marketing is all about helping others succeed so that you can succeed because that's the that's that's the way to do it you know you, you can't be a crab you, you have you have to help everybody else and that's what I'm all about you know so I'm not trying to get over on anyone I just want to I want to see other people do good because I want people I want to see people in my circle eat if I'm eating you know because it makes no sense if one person is doing really well but everybody else isn't it's no I in team you know you have to have a team so that's what I that's one reason why I make this video too because I'm looking for people that are dedicated and want to build a team and want to do something better wants to change you know one thing that i found out on this on this entrepreneurship journey is that it's all about personal development you have to change yourself if you want to change anything else in your life if you want to make more money you got to change yourself if you want to have above average income and you know things of that nature you have to be an above average person it's all about you changing you and that's one thing that i realized that you have to change yourself you know, you have to want it. You have to be disciplined. You have to go after knowledge as if it was money. Because if you go after knowledge as if it was money, everything else will just fall in line. It'll just start appearing right before your feet. So, again, I made this video just so you can look in, just see my life, you know, hear me talk, see me face to face. You know, I'm just a regular person just like, just like you. You know, I have bills. I live paycheck to paycheck just like you. But every day I work harder. To, to, to achieve my goals you know I have my goals written down in my wallet I look at them periodically just to you know get my mind focused on those goals that I need to accomplish so like I said I'm just trying to get you give you a glimpse to see me I'm just like you I have bills paycheck to paycheck I work part-time but I'm looking for something better and I'm looking for a team of individuals that just want something better a lot of you, I'm going to put this on Facebook, and a lot of you probably know me. You know me from school or whatever. You know, I'm reaching out to you too, you know. So hit me up, and um, this is for the people. Peace.